my name is Aliyah and today we're going to be making a DIY sombrero hat in the spirit of Cinco de Mayo which is coming up next week. In order to make this project, you're going to need some crayons, some markers, glue, scissors, some ribbon. If you don't have ribbon, you could use um, string, you could use shoelaces, whatever you have at home. You could use, um, so we need some plates and some cups. The first step you're going to do is going to get your plate. You get your cup and you can get any marker you want or crayon, whatever you have at home. You're going to get your cup, you're going to put it right in the center of the plate. Make sure it's right in the center. Then you're going to get your marker. You're going to press down on the cup and you're going to draw a circle around your cup. It's okay if it's not perfect. Um, it's just to give it that. And it's going to look something like this. Once you finish drawing your circle, you're gonna fold the plate just a little bit, just so you can cut the circle inside. And fold it like this. Oops. Fold it like this. And cut a little bit. And then you're gonna cut the whole circle out. It's okay if it's not perfect, you just want to get the whole circle out. After you're done cutting the circle on your plate, you're going to grab your markers, your crayons, and you're going to decorate your plate and your cup however you like. Okay, once you're done decorating your plate and decorating your cup, you're gonna take some glue and you're gonna glue your cup right in the middle of your plate. It's a good thing you left a little bit of trimming so you could put the glue there. Then you're gonna take your cup and you're gonna put it right in the center where the glue is. You're gonna wait a few seconds, hold it down until it's dry. If you happen to have any extra decorations at home, like glitter, ribbon, pom-poms, anything like that, you could always add it in your cup. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna glue around the cup and add the glitter so you don't see um, the little glue stains that, um, that have wandered off. And I'm also gonna put glitter on the green just to give it a little more pizzazz. Now we're just gonna let that dry. After your glue has dried, what you're now gonna do is you're gonna get some hole punchers. If you don't have a hole puncher, that's perfectly fine. You could um, make some holes with a pencil, with anything you have at home, and you can get your string. Like we said, if you don't have string, you could use ribbon, like what we're using. You could use shoelaces, anything you have at home. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna get your hole puncher or your pencil, and you're gonna make two holes exactly um, on the same line, um, horizontal. If it's not aligned, that's perfectly fine, but you want to try to get it as aligned as possible. And then after that, you're now going to take your string. I'm going to use this white one. And you're going to put the string inside the hole like this. Once you have it, you're going to pull it across and you're going to make a, a knot right there where the hole is. Okay. Once you have that knot, you're now going to put the, the hat on top of your head and you're going to measure how tight you want the hat to be. So um, everyone has different size heads. Mine's a little big, so it's going to be a little big, but that's okay. So 
I see that it's going to be up to here. So after that, you're going to take the other side of the string. You can put it inside the hole as well. And you're going to pull it across. And just in case, if you want to make sure you get the perfect size, you can still measure it to see how tight you want it to be. So the string is right here. And I'm just going to tighten it to see how tight I want it. That's perfect, so now I'm going to take the string and make another knot into it. After that, you're going to take your remaining pieces of string and you're just going to cut it off. And this is your finishing look. Make sure to share all your photos on our Facebook page and make sure to follow us on YouTube for more activities like this. Thank you and stay safe.